Hey everyone, it's been a while. Hoping this weekend I can get some more content for you. But tonight, tonight is a full moon. I've got a pretty decent lake that I like to go to. It is a night bite or even dusk tonight. Uh, hard to say. I like it better in the fall, but you never count this one out when there's a full moon and it is a beauty. So skies are clear. Busted out of work early. I'm gathering stuff. I've gathered a couple people to help me and I want to go through a few tips right now that are going to help you. So night fishing is kind of its own thing. You want to start in the daytime. You want to go around and have this boat ready. As you can see, I've already did some pre-work here. I have my rods, which should be in the rod holders, but I've got two other people going. I was put, just putting them together, but I have rods. Number two, I have a net. Number three, I have my tackle box full of plastics of all different sorts. Uh, tonight we're gonna give Billy Rub uh, plastics a little bit of a shot and see how they do. Start with what you know you need. That is, I need rods, I need a net, and I need that, that bag. I'd probably move this up to the top, but it is what it is. Right up there. Hummingbird, Helix. Helix 9. It's a Gen 1, but I've got a lot of mapping on it, and I'm kicking some butt with that thing. So I'll move up to a Gen 4 here soon. Um, yeah, if anybody's listening, you know, I'm just, I'm just saying I could use a little there. So I've got my locator. I've got rods. I've got tackle. I've got everything I need there. My batteries are charged. Make sure your trolling batteries are charged. I have rod holders. I have already pre set up my lights front and back i've turned them on i've checked them uh the other thing that i love to do that, that can get a little tricky when you pull off at night i've already plugged my lights in i've opened the door of the pickup all my tag lights work everything works here i've had a couple issues i got a tag light that likes to come undone out of the plug-in touch both wires and blow my fuse the most important part of night fishing is being ready when it's daylight out. Again, I'm going to a lake I already know. I have mapping. I have, when I get to the lake, I mark the landing. When it turns dark out, everything changes. Be aware of the boats out there, which brings up another good point, lights. I run two types of lights. First and foremost, just getting around the boat, your L standard headlamp. I think myself and every one of my kids have used this thing to death. I've also got a spot lamp, which you can see here. It's called a show me light. This to me is still one of the best lights out there in the world. I've got it over here on the charger. It's called a show me light. It has a spot and it has a flood. When you're netting walleyes at night, that flood light is a gift. It is a huge gift to anybody sitting in that boat. And the poor guy that's netting your 30 inch walleye so which some days it's me and some days it's somebody else but spot and flood spotlight comes in handy when you go to dock that boat at night and you're looking for the landing so stay tuned hopefully the next videos are myself and my two visitors that i'll introduce later and we're catching some walleyes we'll see you then all right here we are it's a start. I've got a couple special guests. I'm gonna get my big head in front of that sun. We got Mama G back there. Turn around. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Dale. Yeah. Howdy. All right. Lure set. We're a little early, I think, with the moon that's coming up. But uh, ooh, that was a quick little set over there. So we'll see. Probably a lot of. Uh, bass right now I'm watching my rod go stay tuned that's what we've been waiting for hopefully it picks up the fishing for us hasn't been that great yet but we're still after it which way do you want me to pull Dale to the right yep. pull it over here keep my rod tip up right in the middle about mm -hmm. 45 and just keep Ooh, pressure he's pulling perfect Head shaker again, yeah, staying low. Oh. Nice and easy. 
Oh yeah. I'm gonna hit the. Tr Do I keep reeling when I'm? Oh, yeah. Just set. keep the tension on. It's gonna come up here on the right. Or, I mean, on my other right. Wait, whoa, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, sh balls. What, That's like not good. Or That's not good. He's right there. He's right there. Big oh fish. God. Big fish. Nice, mom. He's splashing. He got me. <laughs> right there. This what giant. This might be a f***ing. Oh. What is it? Oh. Get, the, get okay. that out of there. Hold on. Oh. What is get it? Get ready for a picture, mom. <laughs> I'm guessing. I'm going to call that 23, 24. You guys look at me. <laughs> All right. Nice work, Mom. Beautiful. She did the first set fishing with plastics. I'm going to snap some pictures of them. Sorry for the bad footage, but Dale, go ahead and lift that one up for me. There we go. Oh, yeah. Love it. That's a. And, and hold on. Perfect. That. I love it. Right on top of the water again. Okay. <laughs> Boys are getting their butt kicked tonight. There you go. Go right to the right. Pull it this way. Oh, oh. There you go. Finally an eater. Okay, uh, what the Rocky. Hell? Rocky. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm on the board, I guess. <laughs> All right, Stand deep. Dale's got, oh, that's that's a good one. That's right. Trying, how close are we? We're close. Ginny, you wanna grab this light that's down here? Don't oh, oh, oh. Bring him this way. Bring, bring what light? That light, the one that's on the seat. Keep it on him. Bring him in here. Nice and easy. A little more. A little more. A little more. Oh. Oh. You know, okay. I'm a short, fat guy. <laughs> I cannot reach that far. Did I just beat mom? Uh, I'm gonna, close. I'm going to call this one 23. Yeah. All right, peeps. Let's get this one. Me back up. Beep, beep, beep. All right, let's lay him down. Put him right on the seat. I know the guy is sitting there. Yeah. <laughs> well, he might grow a little bit. All right, we'll get back to you with a with a dimension on this one. Nice fish. Nope. I don't see it. You don't need to. Just hold yet. it where the line is. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> got a bite. Nope. Oh, yeah. <laughs> or we could not no. swear. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, yep. There's a good one. There's another good one, guys. New we're going to bleep that out. <laughs> yeah, we're going to take that out. <laughs> All right. It's too late. Too late for this old guy. Um, not, these, not, not these youngsters around me, but we had... We had a good night. I'm trying to try keep you in the light here, but we had a good night. We started three big fish, a 25, a 24, and another 25. We all caught fish. We caught another one more for the, the bucket in here to, to eat for breakfast tomorrow. But again, we were using plastics. We used some of the billy rub stuff, but we went back to the ringtails and they worked fabulous. The electric chicken and what I call the purple headed monster never fails me. So trolling at about 1.5 miles an hour. It was a beautiful night. As you can see, I don't know if you can see that back there. Oh yeah, right there. There's your picture right there, guys. That is a, a beautiful night. I had beautiful company here. Thanks guys for coming out with me. I'm glad you had a great night and maybe we'll repeat tomorrow. Thanks for having me. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks everybody, Outdoor Cruise. We'll see you on the next episode.